What women want the most from man, it can be summarized in just one word, presence. I've been coaching men and women for like years and, you know, taking men into developing qualities that are going to make them more attractive to women as well. And then I hear all the feedback that is coming from women and it always comes back to the same thing. I want a man who is in his power, who is in his alignment, who is in his truth. I want a man who can reflect to me, who can be strong and powerful. So this alignment, this power, it's a state of being. It's a state of maturity. It's a state of vision, a state of mission, a state of energetic, emotional alignment, where nothing can be touched, nothing can destabilize him. And so what this does to a woman, when she feels a man like that, it gives a sense of safety, a safety, sense of trust. It gives a sense of power, energetic presence that makes her feel safe, secure, seen, witnessed. That maturity is truth, is a man who comes in the embodiment of something that is divine. And so when I'm taking men through like two, three months, four, six months training, I would say that the main quality that they get out of that is precisely this. It is the embodiment of a certain form of presence, a certain form of power that they can bring into their love life, into their couple relationships, into their dating. If you look at it from outside, you know, as external qualities, of course, it's obvious. You know, a man who is centered, who is stable, powerful, mature, of course that's going to be attractive. But if you look at the deeper energetic, spiritual alignment, what it means is a man who is in touch with his spirit. It's a man who is channeling something that is divine. And this alignment, this synergy, this synchronicity, creates this embodiment that makes him attractive, that makes him present. In the last few months, when I checked the conversation that I had with women about their relationships, this is the number one thing they are, they, they are complaining about. Is they are missing men who are in the power men who are able to be present with them, in alignment, centered. And of course you have all the qualities, you know, being a good lover, um, the loving respect qualities, the creative power, all that matters as well. But go back to this, you know, sense of alignment, this sense of presence and power. And see in yourself, if you are a man, if those are qualities that you are embodying, if those are qualities that you are bringing into your life. And check also how you can develop them, how you can manifest them. I encourage you to check it out. I love you.